there were galaxies at redshifts of 10, 12, even 16, meaning their light was emitted when the universe was only 200 to 300 million years old. And these weren't fragile proto-galaxies. Some appeared to contain tens of billions of solar masses and stars. That's approaching the mass of the Milky Way today. In a universe younger than some bacterial lineages on Earth, work through the numbers slowly. A star like the Sun takes roughly 30 million years to form from a collapsing gas cloud. More massive stars form faster, but they also die faster, exploding as supernovae that enrich surrounding gas with heavy elements, which then collapse into new stars. Each generation of star formation, collapse, explosion, and enrichment takes tens of millions of years. To build a galaxy with billions of stars means running through many generations. Add the time for gas clouds to fall together under gravity across thousands of light years. Add the time for smaller protogalaxies to merge. Each step has a speed limit set by gravity and thermodynamics. Stack all of this up and conventional models predict that truly massive galaxies should only appear after about a billion years. Our full video on this was posted recently. Check it out on our channel profile now.